Whilst the designs and intricate details might differ, when most computer users interact with a graphical file manager, they interact with it in a fairly similar way. You single click to select a file and double click to open the file. This is true on Windows, on Mac OS, and most Linux file managers as well. At least as the default behavior. Because there is another method, single click to open. This might sound like a really weird behavior, but if you're a KDE user, this is the way it works by default. At least it was prior to Plasma 6, because with Plasma 6, this legacy is finally coming to an end with this issue by Nate Graham. Plasma 6 proposal, double click to open files and folders by default. This has been approved and also completed and merged into the code base. Some of you might be thinking, wait, I use KDE, but it didn't default to single click to open, and I don't remember changing any setting. And you're not imagining that, it just depends on the distro you're using. So some of the distros out there like Kubuntu, Fedora KDE, and Manjaro already made the switch over to double click a really long time ago, because that's just what most people are familiar with, so it makes more sense to be in line with their other desktops. But if you have no life and compiled KDE yourself, or maybe you installed it on something like Arch and have a clean version of the configs, in this case, it is going to be single click to open. Being someone who's always used systems that default to double click and always left it on double click and, you know, always just use double click, I've never really considered it to be a choice. I'm just like, okay, this is the way that computers work. And I didn't realize just how controversial of a default and now how controversial of a change this actually is. Because the people who actually care about single click or double click really care about it. And over the years, there has been a lot of discussion about whether single click or double click is better. Usually from people that see the single click being the single click and then not knowing why it's like that and trying to get rid of it. But there is this small but very dedicated group of people that absolutely love single click and are convinced it is by far a better way to use a computer. I'll go into the reasons why in a moment, but I do want to make it very clear that single click on KDE is not going away. The only thing that is happening is it won't be the default anymore. If you prefer it, swap it back over and you'll be good to go. So why do some people prefer single click to open anyway? Well, familiarity in the age of web apps and smartphones. Most of the people watching this channel probably had a computer, knew someone with a computer, had used the computer long before smartphones ever existed. Maybe even before the web existed as well. And for people like this, you got used to using a file manager that was double click to open a file. But what if your first experience using a computing device was a smartphone? And what if you primarily interact with a smartphone? It's not double click to open things, it's instead single click. Whether it's opening an app, opening a link on a website, pretty much anything you want to do on the web or on a smartphone is single click to open or run. So it makes perfect sense why you'd want to replicate the behavior on your computer as well. But maybe your main interaction device isn't a mouse. With a mouse, it's pretty easy and pretty convenient to do a double click. But what if your main interaction device is a touchscreen? Whether it's finger based or pen based, or maybe you use a trackpad on a laptop. In this case, it's a little bit more annoying to have to do a double click to go and open stuff, especially if you're talking about using a pen, because the pen slightly moves off the icon, well, now you've unselected it, and it's just not a convenient way to work. And much of the basic touch-based behavior we have is derived from physical things. The reason why you scroll your finger upwards to go down a page is because it's like moving a ream of paper in front of you. You move the paper further up and you see further down the paper. And the same is true for tapping to open. If you have a physical button in front of you, you press the button, the button activates. You don't press the button twice. That just doesn't make any sense. Outside of a button that controls an increment encounter, the only time it makes sense to press a button a bunch of times is when you don't trust that the button is actually working, like at a set of traffic lights, for example. Also, single click to open is just more consistent across the rest of your computer. Your file manager is one of the very few programs that makes use of double click. Now, there are going to be exceptions, like 
in Caden Live and many other video editors, you can double click on the section that has your imported files and open up a file manager to import more files. But most other things, like say a menu in a game, a link on a website, closing a window, shutting down your system, pretty much every other button on your system is single click to open. And single click is theoretically more efficient because it's simply less clicks. One is less than two. A lot more importantly, it's better for those people that suffer from extreme mobility issues where doing a double click might actually be a serious physical challenge, people that have alternative input devices, and people that are either worried about or suffer from RSI, a repetitive strain injury. Nate Graham also wrote a blog post about this change, and this part was the main focus of the criticism in the comments. Instead of making things worse, more inefficient, and encouraging arthritis and tendonitis, wouldn't it be better if opening still only requires one click and selecting requires a simple long click? Before I say anything else, yes, I know it's configurable and can be easily changed, but nonetheless, I have to agree with AC regarding double click from an ergonomic point of view. I've already lost a job due to RSI, and from my observations over many months, it was mostly mouse clicking rather than typing that caused the symptoms. Double clicking when you have to do it fairly repetitively is the biggest cause of all. Nate said in his blog post, in fact, every poll of users I'm aware of has shown that they prefer double click. Really? But if almost everyone I've evangelized to switch to Plasma has found single click a great idea, and almost everyone came from Windows, much more agile, faster, and for people of a certain age, much kinder to their incipient or not so much arthritis, oh look, it's just like when browsing the internet. Cool. Is a comment I've heard often when I've installed Plasma to someone. I'm shocked about these poll results. So, what's the advantage of double click then? Well, whilst it might not be consistent with the rest of your desktop, it is consistent within the concept of a file manager. If you use the file manager on Windows, on macOS, on GNOME, you download PCMANFM on Linux, all of these systems use double click to open. If you go to any of these file managers, you instantly know how to use it. You don't have to second guess, oh, is it single click? Is it double click? Maybe I use middle click to open. It's always going to be double click. Also, single click to open when it's on the left mouse button is going to be a bit more error prone. If you like to rest your finger over the left mouse button and you have fairly twitchy fingers or really light mouse switches, it's not impossible to accidentally click your mouse button. I have made this mistake a bunch of times going through dialogue in FF14, and I know I would make the mistake if I was using a file manager. If instead of using left mouse click, you use middle mouse click, that pretty much eliminates the problem, but also eliminates the idea of how you go through the web, because most people aren't opening links with their middle mouse button to open it in a new tab. Most people just click it with their left mouse button. This list is a lot shorter, but for me, familiarity is incredibly strong, and it's pretty much the only reason I use double click. I think no matter where you stand on single click or double click, we can all agree that it should be configurable. Have the option there and use whatever works better for you. Nate Graham also has some thoughts on this matter. To the people upset about double click, personally I also mildly prefer single click, and I understand and agree with the RSI arguments, but we're really just bending to reality here. It boils down to our market position. People who use KDE Plasma are vastly more likely to be switching from another desktop OS than they are to be using Plasma as their very first desktop OS experience. And switches, no double click, because it's what everyone else uses. Windows, macOS, GNOME, everyone. When we act against this expectation for new users, the system feels broken in a very fundamental way, because when they encounter it, it's in the context of them having made a mistake, something open when they wanted to just select it. In my experience, most people in this situation don't take the time to learn the superiority of single click, they instead ask online for how to change it to something they're familiar with. Do so and then shake their heads at how stupid KDE is for getting something so basic wrong. In their opinion, of course. This generates bug reports, online negativity, 
bad reviews, used support tickets, all of which consume the precious resource of volunteers' time and tarnish the reputation of both Plasma and KDE in general. Distros know this, which is why over time they've been making this decision for us. Kubuntu, Manjaro, Fedora KDE, Netrunner, and various others have defaulted to double-click for a while. The trend is more distros moving this direction, not fewer. Also, side note, if you want to talk about the superiority of single-click, stop blaming Windows and Microsoft for it. They did not create the idea of double-click, that was Apple back in 1983 with their Lisa project. It's been around a lot longer than Windows. So, what do you use? Do you use single click? Do you use double click? Did you know there was even an option to use single click? I would love to know. So let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. If you liked the video, go like the video. And if you really liked the video and you want to become one of these amazing people over here, check out the Patreon, subscribe, Sally Pay pay link in the description down below. That's going to be it for me and... That's a really good movie.